Coming at you from Electric Smarts, Brian Taylor, your host today. I'm with Todd Stevens from GE. How are you doing today, Todd? I'm doing great. Well, you know, productivity is an ongoing theme, of course, for contractors mm -hmm. everywhere. And doing things cost effectively. Time is indeed money. And never is that more prevalent than this day and age that we're dealing with in our industry. So, you know, we talked a little bit about earlier. You have a lineup of things you're going to talk to us about today that seems like a perfect fit for this theme. So go ahead. I'll let you talk about it. Well, really, the focus of the discussion today, Brian, is on our panel board line. And we're talking about three types of panel boards. We start with our A-Series product family, which is rated up to 600 amps. Typically is used to control lighting and appliance loads up to 84 circuits. And then we've got a new product introduction, our A-Series 2 panel, which allows for larger frame branch devices. And then lastly, uh, our, our Spectra Power panel is rated up to 1,200 amps, includes both bolt-on and plug-in versions. And typically you see that product in larger commercial and industrial type applications. Well, I took a look yesterday at the Spectra panel. It's, uh, it's, it's a beaut, and I'm sure the other ones are as well. Now, <laughs> I'm reading here from my notes, okay, but I just want to say there's 12,000 combinations of GE panel board equipment and most are available within a 10-day production cycle. Is that true? Is that real? And, of course, what kind of equipment are we talking about? Well, really, uh, we're talking about primarily our, our panel board line, as, as I kind of walked through a few minutes ago. But, yes, that is absolutely true. And uh, when, when you segment our product line, we start with the A-Series power panel. And, again, that's rated up to, um, up to 600 amps. And, and that is typically used for... Uh, um, lighting and, and appliance type loads up to 84 circuits. You take the next step up to our new product introduction which is the A-Series 2 panel. Smaller, lighter package allows for larger frame branch devices and that's rated up to 800 amps. Now lastly, in, in heavier industrial and commercial applications you see our Spectra Power Panel rated to 1200 amps and that allows for both plug-in and bolt-on versions. You know, we're going to talk about some trends, three in particular. Mm -hmm. Let me read them over to, uh, for you, okay. and we'll discuss them one at a time. You can take them one at a time. First, more circuits. Mm -hmm. Second, more manipulation or modification, quick serve. Mm -hmm. And then more integration other than circuit breakers. So one at a time, give me your comments. Right. Those are really three big trends in the market today, the first being more circuits in the panels. Uh, what used to be... Uh, a 42 circuit limit imposed by the National Electrical Code has changed. You can now have up to 84 circuits in a panel and our design reflects that today. So the great news for the contractor is that what used to be two panels in many cases can become one today. And, and when you look at the other category, the second one you mentioned, the quick serve category, we're really seeing a, a growing desire amongst our contractors to get either expedited delivery or in some cases even a same day delivery of our power panels. And we've, GE has introduced some products and programs to address those needs in the marketplace. Specifically, our Pro Stock Projects program allows a contractor to walk into an authorized GE distributor and pick up a field assembled panel board the same day from their local inventory. Uh, as a secondary option to that, we've got our expedited fast track factory assembled panel board program, which again will serve that, that quick ship kind of a category. Now, lastly, you touched on the, the growing integration of different functions into power panels. And, and just to touch on a quick, uh, well, a few of ours on, on really what is a growing list. Uh, lighting control integrated into a, a panel board. You know, typically in the past, in order to get this technology, you need a separate panel with uh, lighting contactors and relays. Today, we've integrated that functionality directly into a remote-operated programmable circuit breaker. And on our larger panel boards, another example of this, this uh, adding functionality to these products would include uh, submetering. Uh, we've got uh, on our 1,200 on our amp uh, Spectra power panels, you, we now have an option for uh, submetering. As a matter of fact, our company, General Electric, was the first to, uh, to uh, introduce a UL-listed integrated submetering panel board to the market. So we're very proud of that. And well, you should be. So we got quick serve distributor modifications. Sounds like uh, the time is money productivity issue is addressed with that. Absolutely. And not to, not to mention uh, more integration. Now, this must save a contractor time if the integration of the components like submeting are already installed at the factory. Absolutely. It all comes down to ease of installation and time saving for contractors. I mean, the, typically the biggest uh, component of cost for them on, on a job is labor. So anything we can do to cut down those costs is, uh, is a, an advantage for our customers. I'd like to shift gears a little bit, Todd, and ask you about uh, something. We spoke on this earlier. You know, like, now, GE provides a quotation software. It provides on-site drawings mm -hmm. and uh, priced bill of materials to ensure accuracy. Accuracy is very important. 
obviously. Tell me about that. Absolutely. We've got a software tool that our authorized distributors use called Speedy. Uh, Speedy allows us to create very quick, accurate, and detailed bills of materials and it uh, really just allows our customers to be very responsive to their end users and in many cases can print drawings out same day for small project needs to address our contractors. Okay, and then A-Series 2 panel board, you say it's smaller and lighter. Yeah, absolutely. The A-Series 2 panel board is, uh, is a smaller and lighter version up to 800 amps, uh, much smaller and lighter than a typical um, traditional panel with those same types of ratings. So really it comes down again to the time saving from an installation standpoint. Yeah, speaking of installation, okay, I, I thought about this. I, I like to pose sometimes as the contractor myself. Okay, okay I'm a contractor, uh, I've got a job, and, but I've got, I got to deal with expansion. Let's say I, I need a certain type of breaker later on, okay, or better yet, mm -hmm. let's say um, I know a panel is going to need to be expanded, but I don't know what type of sizes are going to be required. How do you guys address that? Really, there's a, there's a couple of options there, Brian. The first one was at the time of order entry, you can add a frame-specific space for that panel. And if you're really not sure what you're going to need further down the line, we've also got a new feature called undefined space. And what this means is you can add vertical bus to that panel in increments of six inches at a time for later expansion. Sounds like you guys have uh, got <laughs> everything pretty much We've covered. We've got our bases covered. Well, we, we like to say, finally talk about some of the applications for these products. Okay? Really, panel boards, Brian, are found in every kind of commercial installation for the most part, controlling loads like lighting, uh, heating, ventilation, and air conditioning, motors, and, and many more. And, and really, in most non-residential electrical systems, you'll find panel boards. So very commonly applied product. Oh, great. Well, look. I just want to make sure we haven't missed anything. I think you guys really have your bases covered. Anything you'd like to add or emphasize before we close today? You know, really just that panel boards are a very key product within our industry, and because of that, GE continues to invest in, in research and development and really just trying to bring more added functionality to that product category. So it, it's a very important part of our business and one that we're committed to long term. Well, we're so. almost out of time. We want to thank you, Todd, for coming in and talk. Todd Stevens from... GE. GE. That's it. The place for you and me. It's GE, everybody. We're coming at you from Electric Smarts. We thank everybody for watching out there. Everybody have a great day. And if you want to contact uh, Todd over GE, uh, give us your contact info. www.ge.com. Why didn't I know that? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks again, Todd, for coming. Okay, in. take care. That's all for now. Okay.